Hey, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. And I am stoked to show you this awesome looking 2021 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon in the limited run color of Gecko Green Clear Coat. This 2021 Jeep Wrangler in Gecko Green has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine with start stop. The eight speed automatic transmission pumps out 285 horsepower. It's gonna get you 24 miles per gallon on the highway, 20 city, and an average of 21 miles per gallon on this Jeep. Once again, Gecko Clear Coat is the color. This is a limited run color for 2021. We were lucky enough to get one of them and I'm super excited to do the video. Paint coat on it is PFM, if you were curious and uh, just a really good looking color uh, and it looks just as good in the picture studio as it does outside and it's really an amazing looking color. They used to have it on the JKs a couple of years, I think around 2012 or something around, around there they had Gecko Green, but they brought it back for the JLs and it looks fantastic. We're gonna walk around the vehicle. I apologize for the uh, noise that's going on in the background, we're actually building on our standalone Jeep building, and that's gonna be coming in um, early 2022, but they're starting construction today, um, same day we get this Wrangler, so kind of makes sense. Uh, you get the little sandals on that plastic piece there, a uh, little Easter egg for you. You get the Rubicon stickers on the hood. These are a $995 rim option for this Wrangler with the polished aluminum lips. It has BF Goodrich All-Terrain TA KO2 tires. These are LT28570 R17s and they got a pretty nice all-terrain tread pattern to them. This one also has, if you notice, the color match fender flares as well as the color match hardtop, which are options on the Wrangler Rubicon. It also has the 3M tape on the back fenders, which I really like. You know, the Jeep's thinking about your investment. A lot of times on the used end, those come in pretty chewed up on the JKs, but on the JLs, they, if they're color matched, they put the 3M tape. You get the rock rails on here as well. We'll take a look at the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this at any point. I'm not gonna go over everything, but just some of the main points. 2021 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. 3.6 liter, eight speed automatic transmission. You get the Jeep Wave membership backup camera, the uh, four, four to one rock track, heavy duty part-time four wheel drive system, uh, 410 gears, off-road plus mode, uh, performance suspension, all that good stuff there. And then the optional equipment, the limited edition Gecko Green clear coat is $395. Leather trim bucket seats are $1625. The customer preferred package of 25R, which gives you the premium sound in 8.4 with nav, is a $1,995 option. You get the Alpine premium audio, the Uconnect 4C with nav, GPS nav, uh, the Sirius Guardian for a year, Sirius Travel Link and Traffic Plus for five years, an emergency assistance call, 4G LTE Wi-Fi hotspot. Safety Group is a $995 option, and that gives you the backup parking system uh, assist system and LED tail lamps. Somebody just asked me about LED tail lamps on these vehicles and uh, the only way to get them or one of the ways to get them is with that safety group. Advanced safety group which gives you automatic high beam headlamp control, full speed forward collision warning plus, adaptive cruise control with stop and advanced brake assist is $795. You get the 8 speed automatic transmission which is a $2,500 option. The 3.6 liter is a $750 option. Remote proximity keyless entry or the enter and go system is $695. So you just have to have the key fob in your pocket and the doors will automatically unlock. And it's a push button start. Uh, body color three piece hard top is a $2,545 or $2, $2, option. You get the storage bag and the rear window defroster and wiper and washer. It does not have a soft top. The satin black grill by Mopar is an option. It's $325. Body color fender flares are $695, and those special rims are $995. This one does have remote start as well, which is a $495 option. Total MSRP is $55,820, suggested retail price. 
um, you know, with the limited availability on vehicles right now, the, the prices are kind of crazy. Um, I know that we do have this one listed for over MSRP just because of the high demand for brand new vehicles right now and the limited availability. But you can get your summit price. What we are asking for this vehicle in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website to this vehicle. So click that and check us out there. This one does have the three year 36,000 basic limited bumper to bumper warranty, five year 60 powertrain. There are your miles per gallon, 24 highway, 20 city, and 21 average. You do have the front crash test rating of four stars and the rollover of three stars. We're gonna continue with our outside walk around here. And that color match hardtop is color matched all the way on top there. So that looks really good, the LED tail lamps. We'll turn the vehicle on at the end of the, at the, end of the video, or at least the lights on and then we'll do a final walk around with all the lights on. You do get those backup parking sensors, the red tow hooks, the matching spare tire and rim. There's your HD backup camera. And then uh, you can see that tread pattern a little bit better here on the spare. Back here, you have the factory subwoofer. There is a little bit of storage, but uh, mainly for your roof bolts, door hinge bolts, and windshield bolts. Um, these seats fold down and then they fold up for extra storage or you can just grab this bar and then take that whole seat out completely if you wanted. A lot of extra storage and then you can see that all the bars are color matched in here so when you have the hard top off it all matches really nicely and then you can see that you can take these hard top pieces off so there's three bolts on the side, two on the top and then there's two quick disconnects to get this off. We actually did a demo on a JL on how to remove your hardtop and you can check out that video in the upper right hand part of the screen um, really in depth and shows you step by step how to remove your hardtop without damaging it and it's a really good video I think. Um, people have really liked it on YouTube. Anyways, so this closes like so and these doors they've made lighter uh, than the old JK's you have wheelbase for the two-door, four-door, overall length, water fording, and all that information on that badge right there. The thing I like about these doors is they close nice and smoothly now. Um, they used to kind of have a hinge on them and they didn't always close the best. Uh, the metal fuel door right here. Somebody said they were plastic. That's not plastic, that's metal. Um, anyways, coming down the side here, you have the enter and go system if it's got the little dot here. Notice you do get blind spot monitoring on here, heated mirrors. Now it doesn't say anything about blind spot monitoring on the window sticker, but it does have it. And I think that's part of that um, rear cross path detection system. Inside the leather trim seats give you the red stitching, the red Rubicon stitching on the backrest, and that is the actual stitching on there. If you have your HD capabilities on, turn those on. Driver's seat height adjuster, lumbar. These are still manual seats. Uh, you do get side airbags right there. The back seats are trimmed out the same way. You get the latch child safety system for any child car seats. There is your bag for that hard, the front hard top pieces. And you can see when the headrests are down, you have a nice view out that window. Power mirrors, power locks will hop inside uh, auto headlamps tilt telescopic steering wheel. We'll turn the ignition on so you can check out the instrument cluster and the radio inside here. Notice you get the cool Rubicon animation at the beginning there and uh, the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer, uh, compass, outside temperature display, and you can change those to read whatever you want. You have the leather wrapped steering wheel Cruise controls on the right, adaptive cruise controls right there. So it'll maintain a certain distance between the car in front of you and yourself. So if they speed up, it'll maintain that distance if you have your cruise set to faster than that. Or if they pull off in front of you so that you're open, it'll go to your normal cruise. But it'll always maintain the distance that you select on there. So that's a really cool safety feature. Uh, information center controls and Bluetooth controls on the left and you do get audio controls on the back of the steering wheel and I do like that red stitching on the steering wheel as well. This is the 8.4 4C radio with the navigation. 
gives you AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on here. You saw the factory navigation. Remember, it gives you Sirius Guardian for a year and traffic and travel link plus for five years. That comes with this radio. You can also do your backup camera here. I like to point out just how nice and crystal clear that backup camera is. Those grid lines are dynamic, meaning that they're going to turn as you turn that steering wheel to kind of show you where you're headed to in the future if you're backing up. And then you have uh, your different apps here, including your off-road pages, which are really cool. This one also has, they always have some good um, animation there as well. You get your pitch and roll. You also have your latitude, longitude, your altitude. Uh, you have your different accessory gauges on there. And uh, you have your drivetrain right here. So it tells you your steering angle. So as I turn that, you can see that changes. And also, you know, if you're in off-road and you're not really sure where you're at as far as your sway bars and axles are being locked and stuff, you can go to this page and it'll tell you right there. So really cool stuff. And then you also have um, your different apps. You have obviously the Wi-Fi hotspot, projection manager, where you can project your cell phone to the screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. We actually did a demo on Android Auto on an 8.4. If you want to check that out, that video is in the upper right hand part of the screen. Climate controls down here if you don't like doing them on the radio. Uh, you also have volume and tune controls, start stop capabilities. You can turn those off. Stability control, parking sensors, you can turn those off. Speed crawl control, and you can turn the screen off altogether. Down here, your window switches, AUGS, USB, USB C jack. And then down here, this is what makes a Rubicon. A Rubicon is the uh, sway bar disconnect, the rear lockers, or the front lockers. You can do both or just the rear and then you get this off-road plus mode uh, which is a pretty cool system too there is your eight-speed automatic transmission 4x4 shifter on the floor you get the keyless entry with the remote start on there you get the hideaway key that flips out nice bulky key fob I've always liked these key fobs since this body style came out and it, you can actually store your key right in that little holder there so you always know where it is because this is a proximity key you just have the push button start you get the red dash on this particular one notice the little wrangler climbing up your windshield there has all led lights on the interior now which are pretty cool and bright and then of course your quick disconnects for your front hard top pieces once again you can check out that demo on how we remove the hard top that's on how to get these off that's in the upper right hand part of the screen again so click that and check that out. You get your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems, and you get assist and SOS buttons in the rear view mirror, or up above the rear view mirror, and then you get your auto dimming rear view mirror. And once again, notice seven slots right above there. So they always keep that um, sort of theme going. Factory floor mats come with this G. Uh, the other thing you, you have is your doors, they come off with the T50 wrench. We actually did a demo on how to remove your hard or your doors on your JL. If you want to check out that video, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen. And as promised, I will uh, do a final walk around here with all the lights on. Notice you do get the LED license plate lights and those LED tail lamps look really good, especially on the gecko green. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and I hope from this HD video, you will have been able to get a really good idea of the overall look, styling, options, and color, of course, of this particular Wrangler. Um, if this was a four-door, I'd be extremely tempted to buy it. Uh, I got two twin boys, but uh, two-door probably won't cut it for me. Anyways, thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe subscribe and share click the bell notifications we do videos on our new and used inventory each and every day here at summitauto.com and in fact if you want to subscribe to our youtube channel in the upper left hand part of the screen is a subscribe button a link to more wrangler videos like this one in the upper right a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left and a link to one of our latest youtube videos in the lower right click those check us out and we're super excited to be offering the brand new 2021 jeep wrangler two-door Rubicon in Gecko Green Clear Coat. Thanks again for checking out the video and remember to like, subscribe, and share.